Hey guys, welcome back to Cruising Kisma. Hello. I'm Josh. I'm Sophie. And we are currently cruising on this fantastically beautiful day. Isn't it absolutely glorious? Feels, feels, like, the first, on. feels like the first day in, I don't know how long, in the, the month that yeah. it's actually been nice, nice weather. Yeah, we shared a video um, a, f a few days back that uh, Northern Ireland in particular has received the most amount of rainfall in July and it beat its prior record in 1936, I think. Wow. Most amount of rainfall in July. There um, you go. Which was, which was quite depressing. <laughs> it was horrible. It is, but here we're making the most of it. Yep. Um, we're currently cruising on a little bit of a journey to, I've forgotten the name already, what's the jetty called? Galoon, I think it's called. Galoon Jetty, um, yep. which is just after Crom Castle, if you know where that is, or Crom Castle, as people call it. Crom, yeah. Um, so it's, it's only going to be a day or two, um, just so we can get out in the water while the weather is nice. Exactly. So Trying to make the most of it in these days. <laughs> exactly. So uh, come along for the ride. When we are out on a boat, it's a perfect time to dry all the clothes, especially in this weather. Hello from the edit. <laughs> um, this is a little narration about our journey from Armouring to Galoon. Yeah. Uh, we passed this jetty, which is Cordiller. Cordiller, which is halfway underwater. Or no, it's been removed, hasn't it's it? It's been removed, but it still is pretty, pretty it, high. It was closed off for a good part of the year last year. Yeah. And we're currently making our way through um, Lady Craig Avon Bridge. Not yet. Or not yet. No, but we're <laughs> we're we're gonna make our way. Do you remember to... that there's an island right here that has two doggies on it. Yes, I remember there's an island. So it'd be on your. So it'd be on the left at the minute. <laughs> um, there was two donkeys on the island, and they were there for a really long time. I remember you were worried about them. I got you? really worried. So I did phone the RSPCA. Yeah. Um, but they think they're okay. I think they're okay, yeah. Uh, lots of these islands around are actually owned by farmers and we actually saw a cattle trawler today, didn't we? Yeah. Um, transporting the cows from island to island, well, which is pretty cool. What's I think, having you know, a cow going on the, the water? Well, they weren't very <laughs> happy because they were making a lot of noise whenever they were getting off, so I don't think they were too happy about oh it. Um, these are your fishermen. They hire the boats from, I believe, Watermill Lodge, and a lot of them are actually French Austrian, German, Swiss, yeah. Swiss, yeah. Uh, very competitive fishermen, aren't they? Yeah. And they do produce a wake. <laughs> <laughs> now we're coming up to Lady Craig Avon Bridge. Yep. And uh, this is actually a nightmare to drive across because it's very narrow. You can really only fit one car across at a time. Um, so it's very dangerous. I've seen a few accidents. But it's very wide to drive under. <laughs> it is, it's lovely to drive under. Um, actually the water levels are really high at the minute. Yeah, very high. So the bridge was quite quite high up for us. Not um, too bad. I mean, we, we've norm we normally are, aren't worried about it. But yeah, but if you had like a, a sailing mast for example, mm -hmm. it would be way way worse. Yeah. So, so yeah, we're past it now. Yeah, um, the little markers you can see uh, just let us go under one part of the bridge. Um, some bridges you can go under two different arches, so one to and one from, but this one is just a one-way system, so it's honestly the rule is in the lock. Mm. Whoever gets there first or who's fastest yeah. gets to go first, I guess. And that was, what was that marina there? Uh, that was Derryad. Oh no, sorry, that was the Lockern. No, it's not the Lockern Yacht Club. It is a Yacht Club. It is a lot of Yacht Club, yeah. Um, but it's the one in the other lock, so it's a yeah. different one. Ooh, this is a fun island coming up. Yes. <laughs> As you see me zoom into the again one of those cattle trawlers, which are I think yep. being used for, for people, and and cars actually as well. Really cars? Yeah, yeah. Well. So what is this island, Josh? What is this, this interesting <laughs> island? <laughs> this is a high Christian island. Um, yep. So I've never been on it myself. Have no, <laughs> no, we haven't. Um, it was always something we wanted to do, but I don't think it's working in like as in it's operational anymore. Yeah, um, so they're, they're, they're religious people and they own yeah. this island and they obviously use it for their whatever they do on it. This boat here uh, was actually on the Harakrishn Island, but for, for some a long reason, time, yeah. Yeah, for some reason it's changed on the opposite side. Um, I think it's someone's work in progress. Yeah, like a little houseboat, so. These, these people <laughs> sun themselves, enjoying the weather while it lasted for yeah. all of two days. I know. Like we really wanted to go out um, just when the weather was good, just take that opportunity to go because if we were going to ponder about it, 
it would probably rain again, so... Exactly. <laughs> um, yeah, it was an absolutely glorious day. And we were really lucky there was no wind as well. So it was just like cutting through glass with the lock. Makes it so much easier to travel. Mm -hmm. You know, it's more efficient as well in the water. Yeah, definitely. Um, this, that little jetty there uh, is called Geeklum. Yeah. Geeklum jetty, yep. Yeah, there's a lot of funny names. Well, I, see, I, you know, I don't know if I'm pronouncing them right because, yeah. you know, it's how it says, but then the locals pronounce it differently, so yeah, I, I just do my best. <laughs> yeah, the, the definitely we're notorious for having really funny names for daddies. Uh, for example, there is one um, in the upper lock called Tierra Ro, T-I-R-R-O-E. Uh, that I sounds right. Tierra Ro, or maybe not, it's spelled differently, but <laughs> Close um, enough. it's, we call it Tierra Ro. It's actually the local said Tierru. Tierru, like tier -ru. kangaroo. Yep. So, again, don't want to cause offence, people. <laughs> Please let us know if we're wrong. Exactly. Um, yeah, these these uh, houses here. Just as you're approaching to Crom, Josh was taking a video off the this boat here. Off that boat, and I just looked over at the houses. These gorgeous houses, right by the water, and two lovely deers just jumped across one of the gardens, which was really cool. Yeah, I didn't see it. So. No, so I was trying to tell Josh <laughs> that. <laughs> I thought you saw a spider or something on the on no. the boat, so I was like, oh, a big grab. Yeah. So this is approaching Crom. Yeah. Um, do you know the name of that castle? I thought it was like a watchtower or something, or yeah. it used to be on, on the border. I don't know. The, I don't know much about it. The island itself that the cast that that little tower is on is called Gad. Oh, isn't it? Yeah. I thought I saw this here. It's like an old uh, jetty or an old, you know, yeah. stone, you know, embankment. That's why I was filming it. And again, there's like a bit of a hidden I structure think in the there. the ice house. Could be the ice house, actually. The yeah. Castle ice house. Ah, you might be right. Yeah. But yeah, this more a view of, of the the watchtower. Um, I've seen people row boats up to it, and yes, I don't think you can get inside it. But I always say it would, it would make one hell of an Airbnb. It would be a pretty <laughs> cool Airbnb, wouldn't it? <laughs> Just looking out on the rapids at your, you know. Yeah. The expanse. It's, it's it absolutely is, gorgeous, yeah. iconic. It's really cool because whenever you go to Crom by boat, mm. it's a lot more interesting than going by car. Absolutely. You don't see that from the road, I think. No. Nope. And you see churches and these this is the old ruins of the old castle, I think it is. Yeah, you see it in such a beautiful angle. Yeah. Um, do you remember going here? We just got the boat and two people came down and talked to us. Oh, and yes. It was an older, older lady and she... Doesn't get out, didn't get out much, and she was, it was really a, happy. It was to see a mum and her daughter, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. And I, I made our day, and it made their day as well. I think the way she said that she was really, you know, happy to see us and talk to us. Yeah, exactly. Um, so there's times like that where we really like to meet people. There's other times <laughs> when people ask us stupid questions, and we have no time comes, for them. Comes with the territory, doesn't it? <laughs> Or but whenever we're just mirroring up, people come over and you're tying the ropes and things, and it's like, oh no. <laughs> Yeah, so that's yeah. more closer view of the of the, the, the ruins itself. I think yep. people take wedding uh, photographs yep. and all that. Yeah, wedding uh, photographs, and um, there is quite a lot of weddings there. Uh, mm. Crown Castle is owned by Lord and Lady Urn, um, and that has gone down from generation to generation. And they do weddings in the west wing of yeah, the right. Crown Castle. Here is the the actual mirror itself. Yeah, um, and I think those are all. That, that structure there, you can stay in it, the, the little cabins, um, used to be, I think, stables, maybe? Yep, yeah, you can actually stay in them, Airbnb, I think. Um, and these two boats yeah. were class. Two barges. Yeah. We were, we were trying to talk to them, but it was very hard to shout across to each other, yeah. weren't we? Well, this is pretty funny. Yeah, so this, <laughs> we actually struggled around this corner because it got very narrow and the flow of the water was very uh, high. And this obviously says, like, beware of shallow, you know, shallow water. water, but it's so deep that it's practically yep. covered. Um, and you can really feel the, the river kind of pushing you back. Yeah. Um, yeah. As you can see, we're... Yeah, we're we did really struggle, but on the way back it was really fast. Well, obviously you won with the flow. Yeah, but uh, definitely we've noticed a massive shift in the water levels. Um, I remember saying this whenever we were going <laughs> past. Um, the sheep and the cows are in a field together and we've never seen that before. <laughs> mm -hmm. But since since seeing that we've seen it a few times yeah, from Mama, it, so yeah. maybe it's very common, we just never noticed maybe it before. Maybe it is, yeah. This is uh, Bunbridge, is it? Bunbridge. Bun, B-U-N. Bun, there must be, uh, I don't wonder where that came from. <laughs> we didn't stay at this yet, we haven't stayed it before, we, we decided to keep going. Um, 
but because there's no water and there wasn't anything to add it. So. Yeah, and it was, um, these boats weren't really, they were just sort of sitting there and it would have been a bit more tricky for us to get in. Um, so we just decided to head on to the next jetty. Next jetty, yeah, which was our final destination. Yep. Um, yeah, so these are little chrome cottages, I think. Yeah, I think you can hire these out, although I just said the map that it was, and I, I'm assuming it's already was playing in the water. Yeah. And then this coming up is Galoon. Yes, that is Galoon. Um, nice big open like basin, this big bay. Yeah, and on, the, on your left here on the camera, there's this lovely uh, bridge you can go under. Mm. Uh, a bit like Lady Craig Avon, but on a smaller scale. Exactly. Um, there it is there. That, that just on, <laughs> just on cue. <laughs> on cue. Um, so it was a really, really gorgeous spot. And see how calm it was again. Like once we moored oh. up, it was just incredible. Do you remember how quiet it was? It was yeah. so silent. No, this was kind of annoying. Um, a bit of algae, yeah. Build up this time of year, it's it's, it's yeah. you know understandable. Uh, yeah, that's Galoon. And the, this this facilities in this place was really good. Yeah. Really, really impressed by it. Um, it not very common. There as well, not that we knew. Yeah. So there's a pump out. There's the male female toilets. You had a chemical waste. Um, shower as well, wasn't it? And yeah, yeah showers and uh, recycling. So guys, thanks for watching the video if you made it this far. I hope you enjoyed. Yep. If you haven't already, hit subscribe and leave us a comment down below. Yep, and uh, like I said before, if you're enjoying these vlogs, please let us know as we want to know how to improve and things like that. Um, and yeah, uh, more vlogging content to, to, to come. To come, hopefully. <laughs> See you in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching.